Hi everyone, today I'm going to demonstrate how to push a DTools system integrator project into Tracks.io for inventory tracking and management. Tracks.io is a cloud-based application that enables you to manage, stage, and track products for your projects. The new integration with Tracks.io will allow you to track products from procurement through installation, better manage your inventory, and as a result, improve cash flow and overall profitability. But before you can push a project to Tracks.io, there has to be an initial setup between SI and Tracks.io. So to do that, go to Start, Setup, Control Panel, and then double click on Manage Integrations. Now if you don't see Manage Integrations here, and you are a Software Assurance customer, what you'll want to do is go re-register your software. You just have to go up to Start, Help, Register, and once you re-register, that will bring down uh, this tab and the setting uh, into your version of SI. So uh, once this is here, go ahead and double click that. And that will open up this interface. And right now I'm only showing one integration, the uh, one to uh, Tracks IO. And then what you're going to click is View API Key. So when you click that, that will uh, display your API key. And then what you're going to do is copy that and then close this window. And now you're going to want to go over to uh, Tracks IO and log in. So we'll go ahead and pull up that web page here. I'm already logged in. Uh, if not, you would log into your account with Tracks.io. And then you're going to click Settings and Configuration. And when this opens up, you're going to go ahead and click Integration. Uh, make sure that Dtools SI is set to Yes. Click the Details. And then paste the API key into this field here. And that will automatically save. And then I'll just go back here to uh, add inventory. And then I'll demonstrate how to export a project from SI and then import that project into Tracks.io. Back here in System Integrator, we'll go to Start, Projects, Manage Projects. And you can go ahead and select the project that you wish to uh, export. There's an Integrations tab that now will display here along the top of the Project Explorer. When you click that, uh, and you have the project highlighted, just click the export button. This will ask you which integration you want to export to. In this case, I am only showing one for Tracks.io. Go ahead and click export. And you'll get a confirmation here that uh, this project has been successfully exported. Go ahead and click OK. Now you're going to want to go back to Tracks.io in order to import this project. So we'll go ahead and pull up Tracks.io here. And again, make sure you're logged into your account. Then hover over the Projects tab here, and down here where it says Import, click Dtools. And this will pull up all of the Dtools products that are available for uh, import, the top one being the one that I just exported. So let's go ahead and click the Import button here. And what you're going to see here is a warning. Um, if any products in this product don't exist in Tracks.io, uh, they're going to need to be created before this project can be imported. So click Start. And this is where you can add this product to Tracks.io. So we'll take a look here. Uh, it fills in um, the appropriate fields from SI, the SI project. Right here you see the brand is here, the model number. Uh, what you're going to have to do is fill in the packaging here. In this case, this is a single item. And once that's done, go ahead and click the Add button here. And that will add. And um, now there's just a little warning here that this customer wasn't found inside of Tracks.io. So if the customer doesn't already exist, you can just click this plus button here, and that will allow you to create this customer inside of Tracks.io. So we'll go ahead and verify this. There's a billing address, and there's a site address, and anything else that you'd like to add here. Go ahead and just click Add. And uh, now that the customer has been created, you're going to click Import, and that will import this project into Tracks.io so you can then successfully track your inventory. Once it's successfully imported, you can click View Project to go view that product that we just imported. And that is how you export a pro project from Dtools System Integrator and import that project into Tracks.io.